to another vlog if you're new here my name is cameron um make sure you subscribe i've been posting a lot more on my instagram sorry i'm being quiet because i'm like the only one awake right now um it's like 7 a.m um and yeah i've been posting a ton more on instagram but i've been having trouble i like think that i'm shadow banned i don't really know what that means but basically like i'm pretty sure like i'm like 99 percent positive that my posts aren't showing on people's um pages like their feed and i'm just like not getting as much interaction as i used to it's just like super weird i don't know why that's a thing so i'm like trying to figure it out but yeah so that's been like annoying because i love interacting with you guys and posting on instagram that's like what i can do like in my kind of like spare time when i'm not posting youtube videos so yeah that's annoying but follow me on instagram i always have it linked down below and yeah so good morning it is friday and we actually have today off we have friday saturday sunday and then monday's the fourth of july so have uh, today off and I think we're gonna go to the pool in a little bit I have like this little workout set on and yeah I'm just like sitting on my couch because I'm gonna do a little workout to just get my body moving this morning and then I'm gonna show you guys my new coffee recipe that I've been loving I have been getting back into coffee but what I do is I make sure that I drink like at least a full bottle of water before I have it because if you're like me, I get literally like the worst anxiety from coffee but I love the taste of it so much. Oh, it's really sad. So I try to drink a lot, a lot of water on the days that I am going to drink coffee. So, yeah. So that's what's up. Going to the beach. Kind of having a chill weekend. We're not, we don't have like anything planned for... The 4th of July, we're just kind of meh. I say like things have been very stressful, intense, and sad in the world. Obviously, um, if you guys know, Roe v. Wade was overturned, and I don't like talking about politics or like anything like that on my page, but I feel like this isn't even politics. I feel like it's a basic like human right and i feel like it's worth talking about and spreading awareness about and i know that i could lose subscribers talking about kind of my stance on that but i truly believe that every single person on this planet with a uterus like you have the right to choose it's your life it's nobody else's so yeah i'm not gonna ramble on about that but i just feel like it's super important and we can't just ignore the obvious like things are going on in the world so i also watched um gretchen garrity's most recent vlog and she i like almost broke down in tears she started crying at the end of her um at the end of her vlog because she obviously has a bigger following than me and a lot of people were kind of just like no, you shouldn't talk about this. Like, why are you talking about this? Like, I come to your channel to, like, kind of escape from all that. Um, but then other people were like, why aren't you talking about it? So she was kind of getting pulled every which way. And I feel like I kind of felt the same way. Obviously, I feel like it's not, like, my opinion isn't as impactful because I don't have that big of an audience. But it was just really sad thinking, like, she felt so confused and stressed and didn't know what was the right thing to do um but yeah that's kind of like the hard thing that comes with being like doing social media and wanting to have that like as your job like you can't talk about sensitive subjects because it just creates like this whole thing um but like i said this is something that's important to me as a person um so i wanted to 
say a little something, but yeah. Anyways, let's start our day, kind of refresh, get our minds just clear, and I'm gonna do a little workout and meditate. I'm sorry if I keep touching my hair. I have like this little, I don't know if you guys can see it, this little piece of hair. Like, what is that? <laughs> It literally, I don't understand why my hair does that. Like, it doesn't go down ever. So, yeah. That was my two cents this morning. I'm going to do a little workout, meditate, and then make some coffee and start getting ready for the pool. I don't know if I said I was getting ready for the beach. We're going to the pool. I feel like I'm so used to saying, like, oh, we're going to the beach. But no, we're going to our pool at our apartment. Uh, and just kind of chilling and I did more than like the clips that you guys saw. I just looked really awkward doing my workouts. I didn't include the clips, but I just meditated and I'm about to do my little five minute journal. So I wanted to show you that. And I have Ollie with me now because he was in our bedroom. We shut the bedroom door at night, so he's not roaming the house. And he was like meowing like, like constantly waking Drake up, so. We got him and now he's bird watching <laughs> but this is what i do every single morning um i think you can get both of these from amazon but this is a five minute daily meditations and it has the day so each day has a different one and it's july 1st so we'll go to july right here this is the excerpt from July. Some of them really resonate with me. So I just read that in the morning and then I will go into my five minute journal. This is what it looks like. You just fill out the day and there's always like a little excerpt here. And then you just do three things you're grateful for, what would make today great, and then daily affirmation. And then it has a nighttime portion as well. Sorry the lighting sucks right now, but I'm just making some breakfast for Drake and I. Just some sunny side up eggs, toast, maybe some bacon, and coffee. So, making coffee, just made breakfast, and I have a little glass. These glasses I can link, they are from Amazon, and I just have some ice in there. Um, but for coffee, this is my all-time favorite the La Colombe cold brew and I'm gonna make a dirty chai this morning so I just recently picked up this spiced chai Trader Joe's so I'm really excited to try this um, and then I just use simple like half and half I like using oat milk too but I didn't have any so just using a little bit of half and half and then of course it's not a dirty chai without some cinnamon literally looks so good i don't want to know why my camera is like not focusing but yum and then i'm gonna grab a little straw these glass straws are also 
from Amazon. So. Yum. And then we're just going to add some cinnamon if I can open this. I like a lot of cinnamon. Gorgeous. This is my little pool outfit. And ignore how wrinkly this is. But yeah, just like a little bikini. I got bikini from Target. I think my whole outfit actually is from Target. And these like the little comfy blue shorts, white linen. Yeah. And then I did a little bit of makeup just to kind of get ready for the day and I'm not getting my hair wet just because I just got it dyed and I don't want the chlorine to kind of mess with it because I've heard that it can make it like green so I don't want to do that but I'll probably just put my hair up okay we're bringing our mateen cooler bag just to the pool with a few waters because it's going to be like 95 degrees out today and then I just brought this little bag, towel, a little baseball cup, and scrunchie, and this book. I wish you could see better. It's a video, not a picture. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? We just left the pool. It's about 2.30 now. It's crazy. We went to the pool at like, I think around 10. So we've been there for like five and a half hours. Um, and I got like super, my hair is so annoying today, but I got like pretty burnt slash tan I can't even really tell like in this lighting but we are in my car right now I'm waiting for Drake because we're gonna go pick um Kaylee up and she's gonna spend the night and we're gonna hang out and then we're gonna go get lunch because yeah, I'm starving and I haven't eaten anything today so yeah I just wanted to give you guys a little update on what we're doing okay guys I just got done editing a video that you guys have already seen before this one that I'm filming right now um, it's like almost 30 minutes long and it's a really good video I love it I had so much fun editing it so if you haven't watched that go watch it um, it's like the video right before this one but yeah just got done editing it's about almost 8 p.m. right now Drake just got home he's in the shower um and we're gonna cook some dinner we're gonna grill some chicken steak i think on the grill so i wanted to take you guys along okay we're doing chicken kebabs and a steak they already smell so good Beautiful. 
<laughs> That's literally so perfect. So I'm currently at Target. I just ran inside and grabbed, I had to um, return something for Drake. And then I just ran out of my favorite tea literally ever this is the traditional medicinals organic peppermint tea it is so good you guys like this tea has changed my life i have never been a tea girl um and i just recently started drinking coffee again but yeah i've never been a tea girl until i tried this tea it is so good I drink it when i feel super super like uncomfortable and bloated because the peppermint um like really soothes your stomach after something really heavy and just like uncomfortable um at least for me um and i'm not recommending that you take this or drink it always obviously consult with your doctor um but this is just what works for me and i feel like it just I don't know, it helps me feel like really good um, after I eat something like super heavy and I'm just like uncomfortable and it's been like a few hours and it's just like not going away. So I really love this and it is caffeine free. It comes with 16 tea bags and it's like less than $5. So I really love this, but 